Do you struggle with under eye creasing? You're not alone. No matter what, these babies are disgusting and crusty. So I've been trying multiple techniques and I have found one that works beautifully. So my foundation is done and just in case you're wondering what I'm wearing, I am using the Uma by Sharon C Flawless IRL. Obsessed with this concealer. This is the NYX Born to Glow Concealer in the shade Alabaster. So it is like a radiant concealer, but it's great because it's very hydrating. A little bit out here. So I just use a very, very small bit. And then I'm gonna use my Sigma Concealer Blend Kabuki Brush, the F79. So this is just a really nice, dense concealer brush. This concealer just provides amazing coverage. Also, you don't have to use that much. Okay, so now then after I blend that, I just put a little tiny bit down here because you can see I sort of have some darkness and I'm not even squeezing any more out of the tube. I just use whatever is left on that little sponge. I'm going to take setting spray. This is the Make It Last by Milani. Shake it up and I'm going to spray it directly on here and I do about three sprays. You're going to literally press that into your under eye area. I'm gonna go finish the rest of my makeup and I'm going to check back in with you guys in a few hours and I'm going to show you what my under eye area looks like. I promise you, it is magic. So it's been a few hours and I am in my car. It's been about four hours actually. So I'm in natural sunlight and I just wanted to check in and show you my under eye area. I know that I'm wearing glasses, but I still just wanted to kind of give you a final look at how well this technique works. And it's super hot and I'm in my car with my windows up. So. I'm gonna hop off so that I don't die, but I just wanted to share this with you and I hope you enjoyed this technique. Be sure to like this video and let me know if you wanna see more like this.